Hello there. Um, coming to you feeling very, very hungover this evening. Um, it was a works night last night. And as always, I overdo it. Um, anyway, on my drive back, um, I was listening to a Guy Nalan Ferdman podcast. And uh, Guy had a guy, uh, a chap on called Eric someone. can't remember his surname. Um which isn't very helpful, I know, but he, he's basically a multiple ent entrepreneur and his latest business is Red Therapy. His website is redtherapy.co and it's the first time I've heard about uh, the benefits of red light for health um, and it was, it was fascinating, basically. I mean, this guy is on a mission to help as many people as he can in, in lots of different ways. So the red light therapy... Um, it basically helps your cells do their jobs better. It does this by knocking out stuck nitric oxide in the mitochondria of the cell. So oxygen can get back in there. And then you've basically got increased ATP production, which equals more energy for the cell to do its job. So he was talking about, you know, when people get cancer, because we've, we've all got obviously millions of cells, and some of them are, are better than others. Some of them are not so good. And if you end up with too many not so good ones, you end up getting things like cancer. So this actually gets rid of the not so good ones because it energizes. Um, it gets you know the oxygen back in there, energizes the cells, makes them much more much better. Um, and uh, yeah, so and it's just it's just a, a device that you can basically hang on the back of the door or whatever and you do sort of less than 15 minutes a day recommends having two days off don't overdo it and the benefits have been unbelievable things like um getting rid of eczema so treating skin conditions and I'm I'm wondering if it will treat rosacea and uh spots because that's what I suffer with so I'm very very tempted to get one um, Guy was saying that he'd got a really bad hip pain and it almost felt like sciatica and after using the red light therapy uh, it, it was 60 to 70 percent better he had it for ages um, Victoria's Secret models are using it to look younger apparently it because it's generating fresher cells you look younger um, and I think, I mean, I just think there's loads more benefits besides. In Japan, apparently, they use red light therapy on open wounds instead of stitching people up, and it heals open wounds. Um, I think, I think we've known about red light, the benefits of red light for a long time, but guess what? We don't use it, um, apart from certain countries. And I think Russia, you, you have been using it for a long time. Um, so yeah, so I just wanted to share that, um, yeah, because it says if you do the therapy too much, the positive effects go away because you're actually adding more stress to the cells. So stick to less than 15 minutes per area per day and you'll be on the safe side. Uh, apparently you wear dark glasses because it's quite bright, but apparently there's benefits for eyes as well, excuse me. Um, always that have got some kind of diseases. Uh, there's been 3,000 clinical studies. There's no negative side effects. Um, most people feel at least some difference in energy and a nice glow to their skin right away. But eight weeks of daily use is the rule of thumb to see more dramatic effects because it's the length of most skin benefit studies. For others, like muscle soreness and joints, some people feel a difference straight away. For others, it can take up to eight hours after use to feel the full effects. Um, yeah, and it was really weird because I went to yoga tonight, even though I really did not feel like going. Um, I was hoping it was going to make me feel better, and it didn't. Um, yeah, and she just, the yoga teacher started talking about um, red light saunas which this eric guy had mentioned on his call on the podcast as well so you can actually go and do saunas 
And he was basically saying when you put your body under stress with things like saunas, it's, you know, it's another way of basically getting rid of those bad cells or those weaker cells really quickly. Um, so that's a really beneficial thing to do as well. And they were both saying that their wives have absolutely no stretch marks from using the red light therapy. They both obviously had babies. And, um, and I mean, I, my son is 20 years old, but I never had any stretch marks and I never used red light therapy, but I know that it's very common for women to get stretch marks. So yeah, lots and lots of benefits. So just wanted to share that with you and uh, I'll see you feeling fresher tomorrow. Bye.